So I'll whip it open. And inside you'll find the solid processor frame, four screws, a dual-sided wrench, and two grams of thermal goop. The first thing you're actually gonna wanna do is open up your motherboard socket and install your CPU. The reason for this is essentially your CPU is gonna protect the pins in the socket while you take this out. So go ahead and leave that there. Next, you're gonna take out your SPF packaging, open it up and take out the wrench. Once removed, all you wanna do is unlatch all four of these screws. Unscrew them all the way until you've got it loose. Then simply lift up and away and make sure everything is clear. Pull it out. Next, you're gonna to wanna to take your SPF out of the packaging and simply lay it on top of your CPU, like so. Lastly, you're gonna take the four screws inside. Easiest way to get them out is to use this hook them in and uh, actually like physically unscrew them from the package. Take them out. Next, you're gonna wanna walk each one back until it clicks into place. Next, you're gonna lightly take this and do one rotation, crisscross, one rotation, one rotation, one rotation. Then when it starts to get tight, use this and just tighten it down. Make sure you get a nice wall of resistance, but don't push too far back. SPF is installed. And then lastly, you want to take your tube of height thermal goop and then go ahead and apply it onto your CPU. And then for the Intel ones, they won't come with the additional screws. You'll be reusing the screws that come with your motherboard. We want to take the ILM Open it up and make sure you drop your CPU in there first. Make sure it's nice and secure. Once the CPU's on, put the latch back. Again, same thing. Take it out all the way. So for the Intel motherboards, what we wanna do is we wanna take this out, take it off. While we take this off, we do wanna keep the screws. So take the screw out, put it off to the side. Take the other screw out again, put it off to the side. And now we can put this aside. Same concept here. You wanna take this out, take the screw, keep it on the side, take this screw, keep it on the side. We're gonna take the SPF out of its case, orient it correctly, line it up, and it's wiggling in place. Next, we're gonna take the screws that we took from the ILM. I'm gonna put them back into the holes. Two, three, and four. And then we're gonna take this again, walk it back, click, walk it back. So now we're gonna take this, rotate once, take this, rotate once, crisscross, Rotate once, rotate once, rotate again, rotate again. Now I'm hitting a hard wall here, so I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna do the same thing here, hitting a hard wall there. So I'm gonna stop. And this one, hard wall here, stop. And then over here, hard wall here, stop. And then congratulations. You've got the 
height SPF 1851 installed for LGA 17 or 1851. We're gonna open it up. So this is the LGA 1700. It's the last gen Intel. Same thing, no screws, but you get everything else. So now we're looking at a Z790 motherboard for the LGA 1700 socket. So that's uh, 12th, 13th, 14th gen Intel. What you wanna do is open up the socket, take your CPU, put it inside, and then close it back up. You're gonna wanna take your LGA SPF, take it out, 1700, and then using this again, we're gonna essentially just unhook every single screw Once again, take this up, flip it over, and then extract the screws, save the screws, extract the screws, save the screw, and then toss this. Same thing here, extract the screw, take this out, and then align it with the CPU, and boom, right there. Next, take one screw, Put it into the hole, take the second screw, put it into this hole, third screw, put it into this hole, and then last screw, put it into this hole. Then, again, with this, we're gonna walk it back, thread it in, walk it back, thread it in, walk it back, thread it in, walk it back, thread it in. And we're going to do one turn, one turn, one turn, one turn, one turn, stop, one turn, stop, one turn, stop, one turn, stop. 